In this video, you're going to learn how to use vidIQ to grow your channel. So firstly, what is vidIQ? Well, it is a browser extension for Chrome and it shows you a ton of extra stats uh, about your own videos right on the watch page and also gives you an incredible insight into competitor YouTube channels and videos. And there's a huge amount of information here. I'm going to walk you through some of the pieces of information that I find most helpful. But firstly, how do you get it? Well, as I said, it's a free Chrome browser extension. I'm going to put the link to this in the description of this video. And essentially, you can just go ahead and click that button to add it to your Chrome browser. Now, once you do that and reload the page on YouTube, you're going to see all of this additional information next to any video that you open up. Now, there is a ton of cool information here. I just want to dig into some of the ones that I find most helpful when creating videos uh, in order to grow the channel and really get more views. One of the best pieces of information here is video tags. So I can see for this, for this video, which I'm thinking to make a similar video on, I can see the tags or keywords that this video is ranking in the search engine for. So if I type in how to use YouTube analytics, how to use YouTube analytics, I can see that this video is coming up number one, as it says here. If I just go ahead and type in YouTube analytics, I can see that the video is number one. So this shows me really the ranking of this uh, video for these particular keywords. Now, how is this useful? Well, if you were to create a video, you want to make sure that you're ranking for these tags as well and include these tags as part of your video when you're optimizing and uploading your video. Also, you can use this information to put together a title that's really going to match up exactly with those terms. So you could make a video like here, like how to use YouTube analytics to grow your channel. That ties in exactly with what people are searching for. And it is a compelling title and it's different to the competitor's title as well. So these tags are incredible just for getting an insight into what search terms a competitor is ranking for, you can use that information to help optimize your own videos. And you can also see what you're ranking for. This information will come up for your own videos and you can maybe adjust your title slightly to make it fit better with the tags that it's already ranking for and that'll help you get more click-throughs. Now, as well as the video tags, another thing that I really like about vidIQ and how it helps me to grow my channel is by looking at the refers here. So getting social shares uh, is a key part of getting those initial views on your videos, especially if you have very little audience, you do want to get that promotion out there. And things that you can do, for example, by looking at these refers is come up and open these up. And maybe you could tweet uh, this particular ch uh, YouTube profile or Twitter profile here and say, you know, hey, I've noticed you shared out a similar YouTube video in the past. I've made a version myself. Maybe you want to share it out with your followers. You can also do that with other people who shared it on their, their website. So if we look at this refers again, we can look at the websites where it's been shared. We could maybe email them and uh, say, hey, you know, I've created a similar video to what you've shared in the past. Maybe you want to share it out as well. So that's another cool thing that you can do as well as looking at this information on the watch page of videos. There is a lot of information about, you know, the channel here as well, how much monthly revenue it earns, all that type of stuff. And um, but another interesting thing is if you come in and search for something, it can give you an indication of how competitive this keyword is and the relative search volume. So you really want to be creating videos around search terms that have a high search volume but low competition and you can see it gives you an overall score here 71 out of 100 so that is a pretty good keyword to make a video about because there's high search volume and low competition so that is how you can use vidIQ to grow your channel 
by spying on the competitors and seeing what they're ranking for and using that information to rank your own videos and also to help pick the topics for the videos that you're going to go and make. So now it's your turn. Go ahead and click the link in the description so you can add vidIQ and use it to help grow your YouTube channel.